Good morning guys. Welcome to today's video. I'm so glad that weekend is finished because it was crazy. We didn't even get to rest. Did you feel like you got to rest? Kind of. No. No. Like did it even feel like the weekend was here? No. We were whole, We were gone the whole weekend, weren't we? <laughs> yeah. It was just was crazy. And if you guys know us, you know we need to unwind. Poor Gabby is sitting here working on negative numbers. Gabby's working on negative numbers. Okay. Sophie's playing a game. A game. It's not fair. Totally not fair. Yeah, Sophie gets all the fun stuff. Gabby gets all the hard stuff. Anyway, welcome to today's video. I've got some awesome news I'm going to share with you a little later in this video. We're going to get some math done and we'll be right back. Have you guys heard of pinchme.com? It's a completely free subscription box. You like these products? From leading brand for free. All they ask is for feedback on the product. Let's open this baby up. Baking soda, pour cleanser. This is for zit. Yo, Gabby, you have it. For use in the future. Oh, I know what these are. Um, I think it's like stuff oh. where this is a link catcher. It will be perfect for at the barn. Oh, I think that's face mask. High protein vanilla cream. Slim blast smoothie. Mmm, that'll be good. Can we have it today? Lip mask, yay! I want gum! I want the gum! Game three packs! Orbit white spearmint gum. Chocolate sea salt, I'm taking it. I'm having it. Mom. It's a granola bar. We can share it. Oh, Sophie, we have three granola bars. You get blueberry, Mom. Yeah, yeah, that's getting better. Dry oh. eye lily. Natural sleep aid is in this. That's good for dad. This is good so dad's underwear doesn't turn pink anymore. <laughs> we even got Hidden Valley Simply Ranch dressing. Okay. What the heck is this? Oh gosh, mom. <laughs> oh, it's actually made with sea salt in it. Just like a brownie. Every month an amazing range of new free samples are released on pinchme.com. Products range from cleaning products, beauty products, personal care, pets, baby snacks, and much more. All you have to do is go to pinchme.com, complete your member profile, pick out your samples, then give us feedback. No credit card required. To get your free box of samples, all you have to do is click the link in the description box below. We have moved from the computer work to the kitchen work and I told you last week that we've decided to start doing homeschool in the kitchen because our dining room table, wait, where is it? Our dining room table in there has been taken over by Schleich. I notice a big problem here because once we get to the kitchen table, Girls just want to eat. No, I didn't have breakfast this morning. No, you didn't have breakfast. That's why mom's saying okay. So she's got some cursive writing. She's got some math. She's got some breakfast. Yeah, too close to the pantry. Where's that? Um, right there, right in front of your face. Look straight ahead. Red bag, straight, straight in front of your face. Yes. Leave it out. Isn't it weird how you can never find what's right in front of your face? Anyway, uh, crazy things happen. So Gabby just opened the freezer. No, she's, no, 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 no. All right, she's oh, gonna show you. All right, come and do a reenactment. Show them what happened. She was just waltzing over to the fridge. Do, 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 do. So, um, I forgot that I put my pop in the freezer and thought it was gonna freeze. So I had to walk over to the open the freezer door, get it, but do you notice anything? Do you notice anything? All right, there we go. Did you notice it, you guys? What was it that you saw in the freezer, Gabby? Uh, this brand called Ziggy's. Ziggy's? Ziggy's. So what did you think? What did you say when you saw that? Oh yeah, Mom, look at this. And you're like, So apparently I made a big deal because it was a sign. Anyway, a lot of 
of you guys have been asking about what the information was that we found out at the barn yesterday. We might be getting ah, don't tell them. Don't tell them. But before we tell you, I gotta. I'm telling you in the comments below with my phone when I charge it today. She's gonna sneak in there and tell you guys today. <laughs> um. Okay, so before I tell you, I have to tell you the funniest story. I don't know if you guys heard this. Did you guys hear this? The fat story? I was standing by the horse and Fiona was trying to teach me how to put on a western saddle. So she had the cinch and she had it in her hand and she was facing us, Ziggy and I, and she said, all right, let me see how fat you are. So I was thinking, that's not very nice. So I turned around and put my arms out like this so she could measure me. <laughs> didn't know what well, I thought maybe she needed to see how fat I was to see how fat she needed to fix the saddle I didn't know so I went like this and I looked at her and she looked at me and she goes not you the horse <laughs> so yeah I thought she was saying I need to see how fat you are to fix the saddle but really she was saying to Ziggy I need to see how fat you are anyway I must have laughed so hard after that because it just seemed funny to me that I thought she was trying to <laughs> fit me for the saddle. And she, yeah, and she said, I need to see how fat you are. And that was just a funny story. I want to get you running. <laughs> Look at you guys. Look at how cute this baby is. We need a baby every once in a while, don't we? <clears throat> yes, we do. You need help with your math? You're so pretty. He's so cute when you cuddle with him. That cat is a huge distraction for homeschool. Like, I just great. He doesn't care about anything. And he loves playing like that too. Yeah, he's a wrestler. He's a little boy. <laughs> and he's a baby. And we're like working at the table, working away, and all of a sudden we hear pew, and he just races by us. He's chasing some imaginary animal, but it's hilarious. He's a race cat. He's a race Let's cat. Get him. A special vest. He's a race kitty. Let's get him a special vest. And then we're For home. any of you guys that don't know, he's actually just a rescue. So we're finding him a home. He lived outside in his past life and he lived with the dogs in their dog pen. He was full of free fleas, emaciated, and full of worms. And so he was apprehended and taken out of that situation. And now we are fostering him and we're gonna find him a good home. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna keep him for a little while, make sure he's a good little guy. He's pretty clean, sticking to his kid litter box. Yeah, he does have a little he bit of a growl. He does hiss at us. Like if he's eating and I go near him, he will hiss at us. But no, he's a he cat. Won't. Look at him. Oh, oh. Hello, yeah, that's the camera. He looks way brown on camera. He's like not brown. He's black with yellow eyes and a green color. I love him. He's just sleeping and he actually yawned. We're going to check our mailbox. Let's go. Let's check. There we go. Why did you have to put poop on that? Oh, I don't know. To Gabby, the red tag. Sweet. Gabby's. Oh, look at all the mail. Look at all the mail. Wow. Don't show me the name. There you go. A lot of mail. Okay, thanks. What do we get? A box? Cool. Look at all that mail. <laughs> These are the letters and the postcards that I am mailing out today. So just for you guys who are new oh, to subscribing, what happens is when you guys send us a letter, um, the girls pick one every single week to respond to and they write you a letter. They write their own letter to you as part of our homeschool. And for anybody who doesn't get chosen by them to write a letter, we send this little postcard with a little message that we write on the, that I write on the back of it. So um, either you're gonna get a letter or you're gonna get a postcard. And people have been messaging me and saying, your letter came today. It was so, so super exciting. Even the puppies are excited about the, the letters. What is it? Ah, Abby to Gabby. Well, I tried to do the curls in her fur. P.S. The other picture is for Sophia from Mary Dean. Look at this. Look at Sophie. Fine. Aww. 
Keep I'm riding just... good. Okay. okay. I have a horse. She is four years old and she is 17 months high. This is kind of bad. To Gabby, my channel. Check out Grace's Horses. Okay, I'll do that. Okay. Grace's Horses, that's her channel. Grace sent us a letter and it has a message for all of us. And then she says that she's a four year old horse. This came from Australia, you guys. This is a, a Schleich blanket somebody made for the girls it's from- It's technically a rug. From Australia and it is super cute. Gabby is dying to put that on. And the dogs are like, really? You got no treats in those packages for me? That Schleich blanket was from Bailey and she's from Australia. Bailey, we read your letter but we can't read all the letters out because we don't have enough time in our videos to read all the mail. But thank you so much for that. I should also point out that Bailey just got her first horse and the horseshoe on the back of this blanket that she made is our logo. Let me just show it. And Gabby's already putting it on her horse. And is this the horse that she sent the picture of you? I. We think so, and then there's our logo. That is so cool. Toby's just acting that fits perfect. fancy. Yep, and it fits perfect. Thank you. Look at Ziggy. Oh, let me see. Oh, look at my Ziggy. Be strong. Take it. All right, so this package is from Sanzu, and I am an age. She says she doesn't want to tell us her age. I've been riding Hunter Jumper for six years, seven if you didn't take if I didn't take a year off. I had a lot of briar and a few schleich from when I was little. The horses I sent are between three and six years old. You guys, thank you to all of you guys who sent letters and packages. You, you do not have to send my kids toys. We love the letters, we love the pictures, we love the connecting with you guys, so thank you so much. Thank you! The time has no, come to tell you sure. about my conversation with Fiona yesterday. So this is confusing. So if you guys can follow me, I'll be amazed. Here's Toby paying attention though. <laughs> anyway, so what happened was that she pulled me aside of the barn and she said she doesn't know about Ziggy yet. She's talked to the lady a couple of times. Basically, it's coming to the end of the line here. I don't understand why the lady's not giving us a response. I, I don't understand the situation at all. I, I don't even know why I mentioned the whole Ziggy thing. I thought it would be resolved so much sooner, but it's not. Anyway, basically what's gonna happen is this. October the 1st, she has to pay, start paying for Ziggy's lease at the barn, and that's, I'm guessing, when she's going to tell us if we can lease him. If we can lease him, then we will pay Ziggy's lease. And I'm really still praying for that. I, I, I don't understand, like I said, but hopefully that will happen. In the meantime, what Fiona said to us is that she's going away for two weeks. She's getting married, and she doesn't want to leave us without any kind of lease horse because we've been waiting so long to get a lease horse. And so basically, she told us that starting October the 1st, we have not one, but two lease horses. We are gonna be leasing. Blue! And Jasmine. as of October 1st, we are leasing for at least two weeks, Jasmine and Blue, definitely. Um, and that's all that I have to tell you. That's all I can tell you, but we are super excited and we have super fun videos that we plan to make for those two weeks in the first two weeks of October. And, um, Still keep praying if you guys want to pray for Ziggy. I feel bad that it's taking so long and we're all just left hanging, but that's it. That's all I know. All right, you guys, battery's flashing. I have to end today's video. But comment of the day goes to Lib Lob Blog. And Two comments of the day. And she says, over here in the UK, we have something called Copper Fox Show Tours. This is basically where you show your model horses. For example, for example, Schleich or Briar. Listen, in different classes. They're breed classes, so Arabian, American breeds, part breed, and so on. And then there's performance classes, so English jumping, you create a little jumping scene. I'm going to my first, I'm doing my first Copper Fox in October, which I'm so excited for. I bet you would love to do a Copper Fox Fox show. It's such a shame that they don't have them over there because they're so fun. Have you ever been to a Briar Fest? By the way, I love this blog. I love you guys. Again, Lib Lob, Lib Lob blog. Anyway, did you guys understand with that? 
You take, there's like. Yeah, like you. Yeah, a show and you take your, your briar and your schleich. That would be so cool. I wish we had that here in Canada. Mm -hmm. That would be amazing. Thank you so much for sending that message to us. I wouldn't because take we my schleich because I don't want them to get lost. But they would win. You might win. I wonder what the prizes are. What do you guys win? Do they win ribbons? Like how does it work? I want to know more. I think it's kind of like just like a horse show. Yeah, that is so you cool. Win anyway, thank you so much for everything today. And we are going to end today's vlog. We are back at the bar. First thing in the morning. morning. Yep, I'm super excited. So tomorrow will be a <clears throat> barn vlog. We'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.